Hey everybody, Jason Schleifer from Grip Tape here. And today I wanted to talk to you about a new way that we're managing all of your API keys for the Grip Tape Comfy UI nodes. Uh, before we do, you might be wondering why I'm wearing this hat. Uh, because it is Halloween and um, it's special hat Halloween day. So there we go. With the latest release of the Grip Tape nodes for Comfy UI, we have simplified the process for how you manage your API keys. You don't have to open up a file on disk anymore and save all your API keys in some special .env file. You can do it all through the Comfy UI, and that's what we're going to be showing you today. Okay, so here we are inside Comfy UI, and if I click with the right mouse button, you can see I have no grip tape nodes. I go to add node, nothing for grip tape there, so we are going to start from scratch. First thing we're going to do is click on the manager to open up the Comfy UI manager menu. We'll click on the custom nodes manager, and I'm going to search for grip tape. Here you can see the Comfy UI grip tape nodes and I will go ahead and click install. Now this will just take a couple of minutes. It's got to install the grip tape library and as soon as it's done, it will tell you that it's time to restart. There we go. We get our notification that a restart is required. So we will go ahead and click the restart button, say okay to reboot the server. And then we are going to watch this reconnecting toast until it says it is successful. There we go, reconnected. Excellent, I will reload my page. And if I click with the right mouse button, you will now see that we have the grip tape nodes loaded. Go ahead and star us on GitHub because, well, because you should. So the next step is gonna be setting up your API key. Now in the past, this meant that you had to create a .env file on disk and open it up in the terminal and enter your API keys and that was kind of a pain. Now you don't need to do that anymore. You can use the actual settings inside Comfy UI. That is available to you. Here, if you click on the settings button in the lower left, you'll notice there is a grip tape settings. Click on that, and this will give you a list of all of the API keys that may be used for grip tape. You don't need all of them, and in fact, if you don't have anything in here, that's totally fine. We'll go ahead and show you how to set that up now. But if you do have API keys set up through your environment variables, you will see them here for you. So we're automatically using whatever API keys you already have set in your environment. But to get started, you just want to use the basic grip tape. The one API key that you will probably want to use is an OpenAI API key. If you scroll all the way down, and you'll see right here the OpenAI API key. This may have a value in it already if you've already got an API key. If you don't, then it will be blank like this. Let me show you how to go ahead and get your API key so you can start using it. If you click with the right mouse button, and you go to the grip tape menu and click star on GitHub. This will bring you to the GitHub repo. And if you scroll down towards the bottom, there is a list of places to get API keys right here. You can see here, set API keys. There you go, OpenAI API key. If you click on this, this will log you into OpenAI. You can go ahead and click on API keys, click on create a new secret key, give it a fancy name like my grip tape API key like that. Click create secret key. Go ahead and copy that value. Pop back over into Comfy UI, click on the settings, click on grip tape, scroll down to OpenAI API key, paste that value in there, and close this. You may need to reload your page in order for this to work, but if you did it correctly, you should then be able to say add node, grip tape, agent, Create an agent, you get your default grip tape agent. Let's go ahead and create some display text. So go to add node, grip tape, display, display text, connect the output into the input and say, hi, how awesome is this? And click Q and you will see that it responds with, it sounds like you're excited. And that's how you can manage your API keys. You do it all through the settings right in here through grip tape. Give you an example of when it may not work Let's scroll down to OpenAI API key. I'm going to go ahead and type in another word here like not working. So let's pretend the API key is something like that, not working. I'm going to close this. If I go ahead and type in a new prompt here like I love Halloween and run this, you'll see you get an error. Incorrect API key provided, not working. You could find your API key at blah, blah, blah. So it actually gives you a nice response. You can go back. Come back in here, go back to your grip tape, go back to OpenAI, paste in your original key, close that, and let's change this. I love all Halloween parties. And run this again, and you will see that it works. 
So there you go. That is how you can use the new configurations. Have a fantastic afternoon, and thanks very much for using Grip Tape Comfy UI Notes. Take care.